Welcome back Disney Infinity Gamers. Today I'm going to show you what a Ronin level 20 looks like and his skills. So I just got him to level 20 today um, and then let's go to the skill tree really quick and as you can see these are the skills that I bought along the way but I'm going to do a reset and uh, I want to change up a few things. So let's uh, reset right here. So we're going to do a reset. So we have 75 skills, 75 points to use. So let's start. Let's get going. Um, Ronin's, I'm going to get a special. It's not the best thing in the world, but I'm going to get it. And I'm going to leave it at that for now. Um, his ground and pound is very strong. So I really suggest that you level that up as much as you can. So let's go damage increase. Universal weapon block breaker combo. Strong finish, damage increase, and then let's get the u universal weapon attack, check. Street spike, because we need that to get the accuser attack. This, that attack is really strong, so it's one of, my favorite, one of my favorite attacks. Super damage increase, let's get that. And then um, I'll come back to these three. Next, I want to get, let's increase his health. Let's get... The powerful leap because uh, he's pretty agile and it's helpful. Let's increase his speed and let's get this health boost. We'll come back to that top level a little bit later. So now let's do minute recovery, range attack upgrade, the universal weapon charge. Let's max that out. Recharge level one, attack upgrade, recharge level two. It's always handy. Uh, so we have 17 points left. So let's grab Rapid Fire, Range Attack Upgrade to make that stronger. So what else do we have? Um, this, I don't think we'll need that. So we have 9 points. So continuing on from where I left off, I'm in between getting Team Player, Super Health, or getting Repel and Ricochet. I think that I'm going to see a better return of investment if I go this route just because I'm going to have a lot more health and I don't really use Repel or Ricochet. And the ones down here, I'm not really fond of, so I'm going to skip those. So I think I'm going to go with Team Player and Super Health Boost. So let's do it. And I have two skill points left over, but there's nothing that I can purchase with that. So that's what my chart looks like with uh, his skills. Let's go out and test it out really quick. Let's just do his ground and pound combo. Let's dodge that. So that move, I love that move. It's really handy actually. It's one of the best ones I've found. Let's go these guys. So you can see he knocked him out already. One of Ronan's weaknesses is that he is a little bit slow with his ground attacks. So let's get up here. Let's charge up the universal weapon. Let's use it. Some rapid fire, pretty strong in there you saw. It took two charges to knock these big guys out. One. Oh, got hit from the side. And two. Oh, he took two. Okay. Charge that up. He, he's out. Boom. One more time. Let's jump up. You can see I do love that super leap. I find it really helpful. As you can see, he's doing it pretty well. Um, let me put one in the field just so you can see how strong his his uh, crown attacks can actually be. So we'll spawn one. It's gonna spawn right now. And as he comes up, we'll take him out. You can see that in a full combo there, he was able to knock him out. Let's spawn a. How about Macus is pretty tough to battle. On two of him to 
give us a good fight. That. See. That's the block breaker, and it's just got shot. Let's go up. And then. Oh. I guess the other one just fell off. So uh, we'll end it here with that. That right there, guys, is an idea of my customization for Ronan level 20 and the skills that he has. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a comment, like, subscribe, and uh, I look forward to uh, seeing you guys next time.